Two more things, and I think I'm stuffed full. What do you think? Dollar for both of them. Oh, yeah. Makes it so hard to leave, but I... <laughs> Thrifting ain't easy. I'm feeling creepy. Comping diapers on my eBay app. Morning, how are you? Hi, how are you? Good, thanks. Is it just everything in the middle here? It's just everything. Oh, everything? Okay. Yeah, it's a little disorienting, and there's some more stuff in the house. Oh, okay. Good, how are you? Is this your sale? Uh, I'm running a sale for okay. lady, yes. Okay, cool. Yes. So, Jeep, Jeep, and more Jeep. Are we just kind of making piles and then yep. talking price after? Yep. Okay. Is it like everything is up for grabs? Yep. Okay. Except for this stuff right here. Yeah, except for this stuff down here. Okay. She okay. might hurt you if you touch this stuff. <laughs> well, I might charge you extra. I won't touch it. I won't touch it. He's cute. <laughs> Love yard sales. The house is also full. Okay. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Fish tanks are free. File cabinets are a dollar. Oh, wow. Is it okay to start a little pile somewhere? Yep. Yep. Uh, might go over Oop. yonder ways. Sounds good. Yep. There's totes and boxes, whatever, if you need something. Okay. Yeah. I do. 
box. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, that's Yeah, I do. Uh, do you want to talk price a little bit before I get it in over my head? I got a, I got a couple piles going one inside the garage too. I don't want to go crazy before I know. I will make you such a deal. Oh, I like that. You load up and find somebody with a bigger <laughs> So I got this right here, and then. This last stack over here. Can I get 17 for all of it? Yeah, sure. All right, I like your style, so hey, I'm gonna uh, look around. Hey, Jake, man, you know, take some stuff to the auction, uh -huh. but the truth of it is, I can't get her in for under 35%. Oh, wow. I'm saving her money by doing it because we're doing it for linens and candles and right, right. you know and uh liquidating and making her some money so was it like vendor that just stopped or something like a flea market or like where'd all this stuff come from just oh, just her mom passed her sister passed her nephew passed so just everything ends up yeah, here it just yeah gotcha that makes sense be careful okay gotcha thank there you, you go. <laughs> all right i'll lay this down i'll look inside and I'm all sure. right Okay. Can I grab okay. Those. Just go inside or yeah. don't? Yeah. Okay.
room for two more boxes. What's that? Oh, it's still hurt. Oh. Room for two more boxes. We're trying to feed everything down in the basement so that she doesn't have to carry everything. Oh, okay. But yeah, it's just, just so much. Uh. On one hand, there's no reason for me to be too picky. On the other, I don't I don't want to get greedy either. No, uh, <laughs> be greedy. Okay. <laughs> uh, there's just so much. Okay? Yeah. A lot of the cabinets is, uh, that's records. Oh, okay. Tons of them. Okay. And then uh, a projector that goes with this. Oh, okay. And this is mostly Tupperware and tins. Cool. Records in here? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh-huh. Um, I've got a spot in the middle of the books. I've got a spot over here. Spot over there and spot down here. Here, let me take the doll out of your hand. Oh, thanks. like this i never thought i'd find one in november right i'll tell you that much well they didn't get a hold of us until about three weeks ago oh, right. so we only had two days well we, our mistake was we didn't try guard sale right off the bat right because we had to dig yeah so and then pull all the clothes out and oh my god the amount of clothes <laughs> and linens was just unreal but she's being really good about it she's we're bagging them up, and she's taking them to Goodwill, so they're going. Yeah, that's good. And, uh, yeah, we finally got the barn to where we didn't have to drag everything out so people could see. Right. Mm -hmm. I'd be interested in all this stuff. Should I just grab it all off the shelf here? Huh? Yep. Whatever. Okay. some of that
What am I missing? What am I missing? You got more upstairs. Oh, really? Oh, Lord. Oh, man. <laughs> is it this stuff too over here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Most of that is uh, lotion, shampoo, okay. gift sets, toys. Gotcha. Candles. Oh, stamps. They might like just stamps. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh-huh. Yes, yeah, like Man, oh, man. These are like the stacking boxes. Oh, okay. and this one's cool. Check this out. Oh, wow, that is nice. Uh -huh. Like a jewelry box. Uh huh. There's so much. Yeah. Okay. I think I want some of this, but I'll look inside real quick. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that curio is for sale too. Only thing that's not for sale is the stuff in that back section back there. Okay. And uh, she's working on some stuff in here. Okay. And she's got some. The lady's got stuff covered up. So. Gotcha. But oh yeah. I don't. Oh lord. Got table and chairs, entertainment center, and a corner curio. Man, oh man. This is another camera-affiliated Oh, okay. Light. Oh, yeah. Kitchen's 
Okay. Cabinets. Got some jewelry. I've got trinkets on the back wall over there. Oh, okay, cool. Another cabinet. Most of that over there is coffee mugs and crap. There's a electric fryer thing. Oh, okay. Yeah. Bullshit. Um, like I said, table chairs. That curio. Um, yeah. The lighting sucks. Sorry. Oh, it's okay. Jewelry pieces and cowboy boots. Some outfits. Just never pencils, stops. Uh, buttons. <laughs> oh, those are neat. Mm -hmm. Like political. Yeah, I like those. Man, this is a big job, isn't it? Oh, Lord. Like I said, the weather hit us wrong. Yeah. We, uh, we should have just started moving stuff outside. <laughs> it would have been easier to have a tent and start it. Oh, I'm sure. Mostly purses. Okay. Carry this down and maybe take one last look in the garage real quick and then right? yeah i think so the stairs suck okay they're smaller than my foot okay i'll be careful yep sideways works a little easier <laughs> i keep hitting my heel on the back of the fucking stack one more here, here we go all right i'm lost was it this way mm -hmm. okay yes. let me take one more put this stuff up here I'll come right back for that box. All right. Well, might as well leave or, it here and then pull up over oh, okay. Here. You got more here than you got over there. Okay. Total on everything, 32? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you. Okay, hold on just a second here. And if you need any totes or Oh yeah, anything, this was some of it too, wasn't it? Yeah, all that. I think, I think my only problem is I'm going to run out of room. <laughs> so... Um, Tuesday, the, Wednesday, next week. Or we're here to for today. <laughs> Tuesday and Wednesday of next week? Yep. Okay. Cool. No, what I did not. The bar stuff? I did not see that, no. Man, that table's cool. So I got it. It's, it's really cool. Alright, so bracket for it. Oh, wow. That's it. 
that's all in this box? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. And then the box of beans. Okay. I think I think it's in that coat with the blue on it. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that's just yeah, the that's box. the box that that Ford came in. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. Pop it in there. This one right here, you said? I think so. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, stuff is like that yeah that one piece I found it in a scrap pile oh really that, that piece right there on top yeah huh. that's a part of a thing isn't it and it looks like it's part of that thing it looks like it fits it perfectly right I don't know it's a cool piece there all right so if we add so we're at 32 and then mm -hmm. add this this and this what about the spurs 40 even 40 even I they're like it. gone Paul they're gone <laughs> Come on, Paul! I was your first! <laughs> 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 Let me try to get some up like this. Right. Oh. <laughs> I wasn't really sure what that was all about. I have no idea. This, but too cold not to right. try to figure it out later. Mm -hmm. I'll do this for someone else. I'm gonna pay you a load up and then if I have room I might I might okay. I might look for a few more things. Thank you. Thank you for finding those. There's that. Thank you. And then, mm -hmm. should I just pull over here? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Just run over, Paul. <laughs> uh huh. I have a YouTube channel where I go to garage sales. And like really? buy stuff, yeah. Okay. Yep, it's called Froggy Flips. Froggy Flips. Mm-hmm. Two more things, and I think I'm stuffed full. What do you think? Dollar for both of them. Oh, man. Makes it so hard to leave, but I... <laughs> awesome. Tuesday and Wednesday. Okay, I'm sure I'll be back. All right. Thank you so much. You have a great day. You too. Thank you. All right, guys. Once again, we are back in my stepdad's boat hanger. It's raining, but so far this, this is keeping everything dry. Ignore the boat. That's not mine, but pretty much everything else in here is. That sale was amazing. The only thing that stopped me from getting more, like usual, is space. $41 was my total buy cost. And this next week, there's gonna be a couple days where they're back out there doing it again. So hopefully I get this stuff all processed in time to make it back out there and get another car load because this is the kind of inventory that could, that could make my winter, honestly. There's no way I can show you everything. So real quick, let me just kind of scan over some of the stuff so you can see what I picked up to resell. Once again, ignore the boat, but starting about here, 
everything is from that sale. And then down on the ground here. And it was $41 for everything. And there's some amazing stuff in here. There's train stuff, some old Bachman stuff, tracks and trains. Here is an Aurora data racing set, which is amazing. It seems like it might be complete in there, if you can see. And I mean, this can sell for well over a 100 or 125 bucks on its own. There's an old camera light from Kmart. A lot of bar stuff like this Ezra Brooks Flintlock flask, which is pretty neat. There's some odds and ends with like some bolo ties, which, which can do really well. A lot of buttons and magnets. Some old Ford magnets, a bunch of really cool stuff in there. I just grabbed this entire box. It had this old camcorder bag in it. I didn't really buy this because I cared about the camera. I bought it because I was hoping there would be a VHS-C adapter in there, which there was, because this can bring like 30 bucks on its own. Plus the charger for the camcorder. It's a Montgomery Ward's uh, Signature 2000. And the charger's in there and a couple batteries. So that's awesome. There's two more bags down there. One of them has a Polaroid in it. Uh, one's just the bag itself, which is fine. Some old film cans and reels. More political buttons, some uh, Nixon and Kennedy and stuff like that in there. This thermostat here is a Linux, and this model here can sell for between like 70 and 100 bucks used on its own, so that's pretty amazing. Let's see, up here, a bunch more bar stuff. I've not even really went through all this, but there's a bunch of cool core spouts, corks, and stuff like that. Some really old, old cool stuff. There's a, there's a random cosmetic, a new. A bunch of neat stuff in there. An old bar spoon. Here's another great find. It's a Tyco Pro Racing uh, slot car set. Again, a lot of stuff still in there, possibly complete. A couple slot cars, which are a lot of times money on their own. I think that's the police car from Dukes of Hazard right there, so that's pretty neat. Move some more stuff. Here's an old Saki set from I don't know when, but it's never been open, so that, that was pretty neat. Don't know what I'll end up doing with that, but didn't want to leave it behind for these prices. Some electronics. Here is a, I think it's a GE transistor radio. There's two complete Atari 2600 systems in there with lots of joysticks. Uh, that was that was one of my first finds. There's a case with some eight tracks in it. Just some random eight tracks. Probably probably nothing great, but you know even those cases can sell. There's a vintage Furby with the tag still on it from 1998. Uh, a meter, an old Panasonic pencil sharpener. This is actually maybe one of the best things from this lot. This is a vintage unopened hacky sack from Whammo. Uh, recent comps on this are well over $100, uh, maybe even closer to two, being new in the package like this. Some more old bottles, dark eyes. Never seen one that old, pretty cool. A cabbage patch from 1982. More odds and ends on JW Dance Americana collection. I think that one might be full still. This is pretty neat. It's an old toolbox full of vacuum tubes. I like it was probably like a TV repairman or something, but there's a lot of a lot of vacuum tubes in here. Some testers, a Namco proximity switch, some old grills, a lot of tubes still in the box. This bag's full of tubes. Oh, that was neat. Space permitting, I probably would have grabbed all the toolboxes they had, but this was the one that looked the most interesting because of the stuff inside it. Some random cosmetics, some more bottles. There's an old CB radio, a Johnson 50th anniversary Messenger 250. Uh, some old models here. There's a Ford 49 Coupe, Harbor Tug Long Beach, and a 1925 Model T. Here's some more bottles from Jim Beam. There's the 175th anniversary bottle. Some cool NASCAR signs in there. I've seen these do pretty well. These these Ford Auto Light shadow boxes, and I got three of those. And there's some more bottles down in there. A cool old ladle. A new old stock Snoopy fork and spoon set. This is one of my favorite things from, from this buy. It's full of like old pipes. Some even new old stock, like these new old stock K Woodies that are here. K Woody flame grains. Got a few of those. This cool barometer. Didn't find any solds on this, but I do see one on Etsy for $120 asking price. And then some more pipes. Steer head. There's a bunch down in there. Another K Woody. Looks like some spurs or something, which is pretty neat. This old children's drafting kit is still sealed in the package, so that was too cool to leave behind. This, another pretty awesome thing that I looked up the value for this false city beer display sells for between like 70 and 90 bucks so that's really cool i don't really know what this pot is but it looked neat and then there's some uh, model train stuff it's from uh, lionel lines there's some metal trains and some tracks this old lamp some more trains more trains and more tracks really cool stuff 
and then one of these old Coleman jugs that I love to pick up. So that's just kind of an overview of everything. Very overwhelming sale, but I do hope I get to go back. But that's all I got for you this time, guys. As always, I want to thank you so much for watching the video. But until next time, stay safe, stay healthy. Love ya. Bye. When they hear that cha-ching and they all look at me, I guess they'll know I'm buying this crap.